it's Ashley from Life by Ashley Fichet, where I invite you to join me in living intentionally by faith every day. Welcome to Caffeinated Conversations. It is the last Friday of October, and I don't know about you, but this month has gone by so fast. Um, if you haven't noticed, if you're not a regular reader, or if you're a regular reader who just wasn't paying attention, I've kind of been skimping on the content this month. I'm sorry about that. It was not intentional. I really did have a great month of posts planned for you guys, um, but my writing focus has been elsewhere this month. Um, I've got some stuff going on behind the scenes that I'm working on, and so my blog has just been neglected, and I apologize. That will be getting better, I hope. Um, one way that it's going to get better is I am going to be hosting during the month of November and then into the first couple weeks of December a book club um, with from Renee Swope's A Confident Heart. Um, it's a great book. I highly recommend you read it. Uh, it's all about trusting the promises of God um, and let, letting those promises affect how you live your life. When I first picked up the book, I thought, this, I'm not sure this is for me. I don't live in doubt. I, you know, I'm confident about who God is and about you know, what he says in his word about it being true. But what I didn't realize until I got about you know two pages into the book was that I'm not necessarily, just because I believe that in my head doesn't mean that I'm living that out, that my heart believes it. And so I want to work through this book chapter by chapter with you guys. And we're going to be doing that on Tuesdays and Thursdays um, during November. And then, like I said, into the first couple weeks of December, there's 12 chapters. So it'll be seven weeks altogether because we won't have um, a book club meeting on Thursday Thanksgiving, um, American Thanksgiving for those of you who don't live in Thanksgiving or don't live in America is the 24th of November and we will not be having a post that day for the book club. But the other Tuesdays and Thursdays um, until we're done with the book, there's like I said there's 12 chapters, so seven weeks, we're going to be having a, um, a vlog on here on the blog each of those days where I, basically I go at the end of each chapter she's got some questions for reflection. I'll pick a couple of those questions to answer um, personally and I'll share those with you in a vlog and I'll also probably share a couple quotes or some other things that the chapter you know brought to light in my own life and I'd encourage you guys to do the same if you're a blogger I'd love for you to blog about it and then link up I'll have a link up available each session um, if you're not a blogger or you just don't want to blog about it join us in the comments I'd love to have you I want this to be really interactive um, a lot of community around this book club that we're going to be doing I'm really excited about it. I've got um, a number of people who've already told me they've gotten their books and are, you know, excited to dig in. And um, I'm going to actually start recording the vlogs today, so I'm very excited about that as well. I've gotten um, a good couple chapters into the book, and I'm really excited to share that with you. So that's one way that we're going to be putting content on the blog during November, um, and that I hope will encourage you. I want to also continue doing my regular Friday caffeinated conversations as much as possible just to give you an update on what's going on in my life, what God's doing in my life, um, and just to encourage you in that way. And then also during the month of November, I'm going to be adding a new feature on Wednesdays. Um, if you've been with me for very long, for you know a year or so, if you've been following the blog, you'll know last fall I did a series called What I Wore Wednesday or Getting Dressed Works For Me. Um, basically, fall hits and it's really tempting to stay in our pajamas all day or especially for those of us who are at home, working at home or staying at home with our kids, homeschooling, whatever, whatever the case may be. If you're not having to leave the house during the day, it's really hard easy just to stay in that comfy loungewear. Um, but what I have found is when I'm in my comfy loungewear, my attitude, my motivation, it all kind of goes into that slump as well. So I, in order to be intentional, am going to be getting dressed every day, or at least I hope so. So on Wednesdays, I'm going to start taking pictures of what I'm wearing every day to show you, you know, some accountability here um, of what I'm wearing. Not because what I'm wearing is anything exciting, but um, just for the accountability to show, yes, I got dressed. And then also, I'm going to use that as my weekly digest post. I'm going to be linking up all of the posts um, that I've written or that have been posted on the blog over the course of the week. Um, and just that will be a way to archive that. So if you only follow one post a week, check out the Wednesday post because that will have all the posts for the entire week on them. 
Um, and then you can look through and pick the ones that you think look interesting to you. So I would really encourage you to do that. So that's three, four, four days um, of content each week that I'll be posting. And I've got some other content I'll be posting as well. I'll continue with my book reviews. I absolutely love to read. I love reviewing books. Um, so I just, I, I'm so blessed by the Christian publishing companies that have offered to let me Basically, they gave me a copy of their book and all I have to do is read it and tell you whether I liked it or I didn't. And that's just such a blessing that um, I just really enjoyed that, working with them. Um, and so that's something I'll be doing. A lot of those will be on Sundays, some will be Mondays, you know, scattered throughout the week. But that's really what's coming up in the next month or so on the blog. I hope you guys all have an incredible weekend. For those of you who are blessed enough to be able to attend the Relevant Conference, I hope you guys are learning so much that you're meeting with God and that he is just giving you some great direction and purpose for your blogs. Um, I was sad that I couldn't be there this year, but I was so excited to help um, Rachel Martin be able to go. I was, the 31 days to build a better spouse was able to sponsor her to help her make her journey towards relevant. And I was very excited to be able to do that. So I hope you guys are all having a great time. I'm living vicariously through your tweets and watching the keynote sessions online and I'm just so blessed that God has blessed me with this community of women um, who love him and who want to see his word be proclaimed through the internet. Have a great weekend and I will see you guys all next week. Bye.